everyone! Welcome to my channel, Tutorial by Sir Raymond. My name is Mr. Jem Raymond Ischen, Master Teacher 2 from Escalante Central Elementary School. Don't forget to click subscribe below to keep updated for my future tutorial. This time, I will teach you how to tag learners using the Learners Enrollment and Survey Tagging Facility in the Learners Information System or LIS. DepEd Order No. 8 Series of 2020 states that the guidelines of the enrollment for school year 2020-2021 in the context of the public health emergency due to COVID-19. This department order tasked previous advisors to contact the parents of their learners last school year 2019-2020 through remote enrollment. This DO also orders the previous advisors to encode or tag collected learners' data from the LESF in the LIS. Tagging facility is only available for learners who were previously encoded in the LIS for school year 2019-2020. The incoming grade 1 to grade 11 learners, the previous school advisors for school year 2019-2020 will be responsible for tagging learners in the system. For incoming grade 12, the previous system admin for school year 2019-2020 will be responsible for tagging learners in the system. To start tagging, open your preferred search engine, then type www.google.com. Type DepEd LIS, then click this. But you can also directly type the URL lis.deped.gov.ph in here. Then you will be prompted to the screen. Type your username and password and click sign in. Then you will see your LIS dashboard. Click master list. Click the select item button. Click the LESF link. Under the second drop-down list, click the Not Tag as LESF option. Search for the learner's name to be tagged. Under the option column, click the pencil icon. Then accomplish the required information based from the LESF questionnaire signed by the parents or guardians of the learners. After filling in the required information, tick this checkbox to certify that the given information are true and correct. Click Submit. Note, please complete the form notification message will be displayed for the required fields not completed. Complete the data. Then click Submit After. Learner's LESF has been created notification message will be displayed once successfully submitted. Learners will be listed under tag as LESF will be reflected here. You can also update or edit learner's information even if they are already tagged. Just click this edit icon to do it. Repeat the same procedures for the remaining learners that need to be tagged. And that's how you tag learners using Learners Enrollment and Survey Tagging Facility in the LIS. Hope you gained something in my video tutorial. Again, my name is Mr. Jem Raymond S. Chen, Master Teacher 2 of Escalante Central Elementary School, Schools Division of Escalante City. Click like and share if this video tutorial helps you. Don't forget to click subscribe below to keep updated on my future tutorial. 
For your suggestions, especially on the topic for my next tutorial, please leave your comment below. Thank you so much for watching. Keep safe everyone!